So remember, just because your gut tells you someone is guilty of a crime is not enough. You must have evidence to actually convict someone. So does anybody have any questions? What if my gut or the voices in my head tells me they're guilty? Well... You step out a thousand set of lives, confess! I would just let Mother Nature guide my instincts. I don't want to stay up in a cup How do you know when the lawyer is lying? His mouth is moving. <laughs> <laughs> that was so funny, I forgot to die. I dreamt that I died once. Okay, okay, everybody, let's get back on track. Having a preponderance of evidence is only sufficient in civil trial, but in criminal proceeding, you have to prove guilt beyond a shadow of a doubt. Oh, yes, Brooke, that's correct. Thank you. Okay, so for our next assignment, we're going to solve a case. So our case, the case is Lucy Cat. Somebody stole a fundraiser money and they thought it was me. Sounds like a case for the detectives. <laughs> let's go! Look, bro, just calm down and tell me what happened from the beginning. Listen, my dude, this is not your average cup of tea. This is some serious coffee. Spill the beans, but I'm dumb. Yeah, another brown classic. What time did you notice the money missing? Right after third period. And Jim, nobody believes me. They all think I stole it. Because you still ain't lying. But that was a long time ago. You must have evidence to actually convict someone. I haven't been this excited since I accidentally drank caffeinated tea. 1811, that's Brent's locker. What's that brown stain on Brent's locker? It's probably Brent's dupe. I think that's just chocolate. Yeah, chocolate for Brent's buttocks. Yep, that's chocolate. What? This is a great clue. The thief left his fingerprint on the chocolate stain. Let's go to the gym. I think we'll find something there. Yes, I did. Because Britt used to pick up me all the time, saying I was fat and everything, and I ate all the chocolate, slept in the high berry chamber. 
Okay. Really? Yes, I did. You have to give the money back. Guys, we solved our first case. 